tutorial today we're gonna go fight the ender dragon in minecraft and you can see that I'm basically full diamond armor it's an iron axe diamond pickaxe some beds and we're gonna see if I could go beat it so let's go ahead and find out as we go jump into the portal this is a good spawn because we don't have to go like bridge out so we all we have to do is just mine our way out. Am I going the right way? Yup, I'm going the right way. Because it's like zero, zero for the portal. And something I have to be cautious about is, is these endermen here. Because if I look at them, I'll need my water bucket. Alright, we got that. I'm gonna scale with my water bucket, and I set my spawn point near the portal, so if I somehow die, I can just get that, and then keep on climbing, I'm just gonna keep climbing, and break the end pressure. What we, I would do is go ahead, and I feel like I should get my bow out. Oh. Alright, the dragon is just chilling there. Alright, we got that. Now we can go sharpshoot some of these here. If I can aim it right. Okay, we got that. Don't keep shooting some of these. All right. How much did we get? Almost half of them. All right, go. We're gonna make our way down here, getting rid of the last few end crystals, and then and we're gonna go use the beds to just destroy the dragon. Cause dragon fight can be quite easy, but if I ever do a manhunt. It's gonna be much more difficult because people are gonna get at just gonna go after me. So we just keep doing this, fast maneuver, and then try to there we go. And then boom. Going after the ones in the cages because they're quite annoying to deal with. If I were to use a water bucket in manhunts, I would probably not. I would probably not do it too much. I just shot myself, bro. I just shot a bow at something the first time. Got that. He did a little damage to the dragon. Oh, oh. Bro, I got... Bro, I literally died to that because I got comboed. I think there's nothing to steal my stuff here, and not that, and I'm not that close to the void, so I could just get my stuff for free. All I have to do is hope the Ender Dragon does not sweep me out of the out of the End Island. All right, we're getting all the stuff here. We'd have to organize our inventory quickly before the dragon does anything. But since it is perching. It's just perching, so we have some time. Bro, what are I... Oh, who hit me? Alright. I need to get my leggings. Probably did not pick them up from back here. Got that. Shield. We need to get the water bucket out, because that's the number one thing we need. And get the bow, so we can sharpshoot some of these. Can I get that one there? I know I can, but I just have to aim it right. There we go, we got that. These tall ones here can be quite annoying. Then, so, after the crystals are done, we're just gonna go use the beds on the dragon to just blow them. Although, the dragon is said to be a good female. Lore wise. 
I just shot myself again. I should just... Bro, what is hitting me? Is the dragon just somehow hitting me? I need to get some blocks. Like, where's the dragon right now? Get the blocks for my inventory. And stone sure. Then... Do this kind of trick. There we go. And then we can sharpshoot this maybe. But I don't have any arrows, so... We have to go ahead and bridge over. Although I could have just done something like this and just have an easy shot. Apparently, that did not happen. There's a dragon right here. Bro, it's... Bro, dragon gathered so many endermen. It's like the whole island. Almost. Alright, since the dragon's perch, we have some time to break the crystal. Going, circling it. If it hits me, I might be dead, but I have to go clutch. Alright then. We have to cover the legs because of it from explosions. There we go. I have to go eat some food. Only food I have is like, like steak and a golden apple. We're gonna do that. I could do some kind of cool looking move and then just use my boat. And then we just boat our way down. Like that. Good thing that bad not, something bad did not happen. My dragon. Right, you're so loud, you're loud, you're loud. Okay, you done so much damage. I need to wait for you to perch or just come from the behind. I have to get blocks. Alright, we got. I don't think we've done much damage. Man, it does so much damage. It's a good way of doing it. There's a lot of damage to the dragon, which is good. Now we have to wait for it to perch, and uh, it should be over. And, uh, this is just getting burned. Man. As we can wait for it to perch, we could just go ahead, take out some of the flames, so we can have a better vision. Alright, the dragon is right there. We're gonna get the bed ready. Although it sounds suspicious, we should be fine. Alright, dragon. Time to rest your body. Alright, you coming on. Coming on down. This is one way of getting rid of the dragon. Oh no. We got a bed. We got a bed shot. We got the bed move on. Now we have to go do one more bed, and then maybe the axe to finish it off. Imagine we just lava it and burn it. Probably won't. Please come on down, I have no arrows. I have like no arrows. Alright bro, what are you doing? You're gonna get, you're gonna get launched in a moment. I could tell. Dragon is right there. Come on down. You're taking too much of my time. The Endermen are angry, try to attack it, but... Imagine the Endermen just gets the final blow. We got another bed. Or another bed shot on. Although I could finish it off with the last bed. Third or last bed. 
we could do it with the axe, but it might take some time. And it's best to just do it like this. There's so much stuff here. Come on down, dragon. Although the flames can go out by themselves, just this will help us like have a better view around that island. So after this, we can have access to the outer end island to find the elytra. Alright dragon, come on down. Oh no. Don't come down right now. You literally covered the entire portal frame. Get back to the overworld. And I only died once, because when I did it like a few times, I like died. I died like a few times on the previous run. Your breath is still not done. Ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. You hurt. Alright, we're coming from behind. We did it, but I did not get the badge. Although I should have, because I didn't get the I didn't get the end badge I'm taking. So we would have to like revive it and get the badge, but we beaten the Ender Dragon. I don't know if you guys can call it a fully beaten thing, but I defeated Ender Dragon by using beds. Although I should have done the axe. I thought I could have just gotten it anyway. Alright, so we can get the egg if I have yeah, I have a slab. So it that should work out. I was able to use many things at least once. And now we have the dragon egg. This is such an achievement. We basically beat the game, but if I go to achievements, yeah, we still have a lot of stuff to do. Both in the overworld, nether, and side stuff. I can close to finish the Minecraft stuff here. Just cure of a zombie villager. And see, and I see that she did not give me like free DN achievement, but let's go ahead into the portal. And now, we're just gonna skip that. And we can leave here because this portal room generation. If I just go back here, you could see that there would be like no no door or other stuff. It's only this. So I could just mine through and then this is like the room where you'd find it. So down here and then we just go around. We got rid of that guy. Now I have to find our way back to my stairway. Which is not an easy task because it's such a maze for me. I'm just going to go back from where we got to the portal room. Because it's much easier to get back from there. I don't even remember where it is. Because it. Oh wait, here we are. Now we can go up the steps and go back to our base. For such an achievement we did even though we did not get it. But we got the dragon egg. Which is better than nothing, right? So as I go up to the steps, if you got this far, consider subscribing because I appreciate the support I would get from you guys. And I try to make these videos as best I can. And not a great editor so I just do some bad editing stuff but we're almost to the top and it's such a deep way down going in here here's the final row of steps and we're finally here and Aspire wanted to defeat us but nah he wanted to kill us we have a nice mountain view there then do some tree parkour. And I failed that miserably apparently. 
but we're almost to my base. I could do this head banging, head banging trick, which is good for movement. And there it is, our base. Well, mostly like my base, and I built it from the ground up, and this is my world. But here we are. Uh, we're almost there to a big spruce cabin that I should extend much better. If a witch, you're gonna be a problem. <laughs> Yeah, he just got destroyed by me. And we can have we can see here that I made a lava generator. So I can get lava buckets easily. And it's much more better than just some other stuff. Just finding lava in caves. So can go on up here. I could probably just make a frame of some sorts. And then got this here, and then that, and then boom. Item frame. And we have the dragon egg. So it's just there, although it looks very weird. I don't have anywhere good to put it. And I barely go down in my basement, which is just nothing but wood. So I could probably just do something in there. My attic is just, it's just an enchanting t area, you see here, we're level 59, and we can go ahead and sleep, and anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me beating the Ender Dragon. So anyway, goodbye.